everyone should know how to do the laryngeal handshake. Welcome back to day 12 of Crit Bits, and today we're talking about a concept taught to me by airway guru, Dr. Rich Levitan. If you know, you know. This is a concept to familiarize yourself with the airway anatomy of a patient who you might be considering to intubate. What you're going to do is you're going to take your thumb and your middle finger and grab the larynx, feel around, and then you're going to try to palpate the cricothyroid membrane. This right here is a 3D representation of that. Here's your thyroid cartilage. Here is your cricoid ring and there's your tracheal rings and this space right here is covered by the cricothyroid membrane. This is where a surgical airway would be performed. And it's always important to familiarize yourself with the patient's anatomy so that you know exactly where that membrane is should you need to find it. People come in all shapes and sizes and for some people it might be very easy to find and for some people it might be more difficult. So it's always important to localize the person's anatomy should you ever need to find that anatomy in a high stress situation. This is definitely a skill that I think you should learn, whether it's getting one of these models and practicing, going to your local sim center, going to a course like mine or Rich Levitan's. The point is, is that practice makes perfect for these procedures that you don't often do, but you always have to be ready if you're doing emergency medicine or critical care. That's why I think 